This walk about Disney Springs at Walt Disney World is brought to you by Keys, natural skin care and skin therapy products. Disney is a very unique place. Walt Disney World is among some of the most interesting attractions in the world. And Disney Springs is a shopping and restaurant area that's equally as interesting. Here Yonokoro is a shop from Tokyo. It has unique clothing and accessories. Very high quality and all at very, very good prices. The shop is usually very busy. Lots of unique items. They always have some fun theme art products. Lots of practical clothing. What we like about Disney Springs is the unique shopping and the various different food establishments. The restaurants are theme based and usually from fine chefs from around the world. We often just visit, visit Disney Springs just to go get lunch. This walkabout is just to give you a quick idea. Here's Sprinkles, our favorite little cupcake place. And across the Lagoon Bridge are a number of restaurants and establishments. It's a fun little lagoon, Raglan Road. There is an Irish pub from Dublin. Great food. One of our favorite places is Morimoto, Chef Morimoto, the Iron Chef. Most all of the restaurants do have a theme of some sort. The boathouse has amphicar rides that you can ride around the lake and also a theme boutique that has various different boathouse type products, as well as some old items that have been refurbished and models of boats of the past. Here's some small outboard motor models and you can even eat in a boat. The ducks are famous. Most all of Disney Springs is on a lake that is across from Saratoga Springs with the central theme being the balloon ride. One of our favorite restaurants is coming up. It's called Maria and Enzo's. There's three restaurants, a fast food that's Roman style, a sit down dinner, and our favorite at Maria and Enzo's is Enzo's Hideaway, which is a speakeasy style grotto restaurant. It has the same food as the main restaurant. Lots to see at Disney Springs, and different architecture throughout. So for us, it's time for lunch at Enzo's Hideaway. So we'll go down there. Again, this is a grotto, speakeasy type of restaurant, very casual and very upscale. The food quality is amazing. The original recipes are from Italy. And 
nice bar. And the food is exquisite. Best lasagna I have had outside of Rome. It's a nice place for a group or quiet dining. All the ingredients come from Italy and are of the highest quality. So we're going to sneak out the back from Enzo's hideaway and we're going to go through the connecting tunnel for the shared bathroom with the Edison restaurant. Now the Edison is a very unique old style restaurant. Art Deco, nice food, very interesting atmosphere. Two great bars with lots of memorabilia throughout. Of course, this is holiday season and the main lobby is decorated. But the old ironworks are very interesting. This clock in the center is very functional and very unique. Outside again, we're going to head toward the shopping district. But first, we're going to take a stop at the balloon launch pad. The day we were there, the winds are a little too high to go up. Uh, this was the last ride coming back. Here's the old area, used to be called Downtown Disney. Lots of restaurants, a bowling alley, movie theaters, and lots of shops. Some fun theme places like a Marvel store. Again, this is holiday time, so we're going to Take a walk through the pavilion shops. These are very upscale shops with all sorts of different products that they're selling. You get a drink if you want it. Interesting, fun architecture that you can actually experience. And Disney Springs is a very large place, so even though the garages are full, you can see it's pretty quiet looking. There's a lot of people here, though. So that's it. This is not all of Disney Springs, but a quick view. Hope you've enjoyed it. We'll be back soon with another video from Chill Travelers. When you come to Walt Disney World, to try to spend some time here at Disney Springs. It's a free attraction and a fun place to visit.